What record does the Incredicoaster hold? Well, stay tuned to find out. In 2001, Disney opened California Adventure and a fast, thrilling new roller coaster, California Screamin'. Later in 2017 and 2018, as Disney rethemed California Adventure to increase popularity, California Screamin' became the Incredicoaster to fit in with the newly themed Pixar Pier. The Incredicoaster takes you on a high-speed adventure with the Incredibles to try and catch Jack-Jack, who has run amok. The ride shows the different members of the Incredibles family using their powers to try and catch him, while Jack-Jack uses some of his different powers to try and get away, such as bursting into flame, multiplying, and turning into goo. And getting giant so he can eat a cookie. The Incredicoaster is 122 feet tall, is slightly longer than a mile, and has one inversion, a 108 foot drop, and is the fastest ride at the Disneyland Resort, clocking in just under three minutes at 55 miles per hour. That's really fast. This coaster is themed as a boardwalk wooden roller coaster, but the coaster is actually made of steel. In fact, it is the third longest steel roller coaster in the United States and is in the top 10 longest steel roller coasters in the world. It is also the longest steel roller coaster in the world with an inversion. The Incredicoaster has tubes along the track. These not only serve to hide show scenes, but help the coaster to comply with Orange County sound ordinances. Ordinances. The Incredicoaster has tubes along the track. These not only serve to hide show scenes, but help the coaster to comply to Orange County sound ordinances, making the screams go into the park and not into the city of Anaheim. The other most notable thing about the Incredicoaster is the launch. Five, four, three, two, one, go! Five, four, three! The Incredicoaster uses a linear induction motor. A linear induction motor uses electromagnets to launch the train. A current is applied to the electromagnets on the track to generate a magnetic field. The train has a fin which is slotted into the track and then is attracted to the electromagnet. An electric field is also generated from this fin. The fin then passes by the electromagnets on the track and creates a current called an eddy current. This current creates a second magnetic field, which opposes the first, pushing the train forward. The train car is then propelled up the hill. Linear induction motors used to launch roller coasters create a lot of heat, so water is sprayed on the track just after the launch to cool it down for the next launch. The water also makes it seem like Dash is running alongside you as the coaster launches. These electromagnets are also used at various points in the ride to keep the car moving, help it speed up, or to break the trains. So by the end of the ride, Jack-Jack has made it back home with a giant cookie and all is right. And there's a happy ending. The Incredicoaster is one of my favorite roller coasters at Disneyland. Let me know in the comments down below what are some of your favorite roller coasters. And as always, thanks for watching.